Hey, what's up, y'all? It's Gabby, and I'm back with another banker video. So, um, today, y'all, um, my husband and I decided to do some indoor planting. Um, we're like, we're living in like one of the colder states, and there's not a lot of sun outside, so we're just gonna do it inside. So, I'm just gonna kind of take y'all along for what we're gonna do, and hopefully, it works. I like to watch videos like this sometimes, so I thought I'd go ahead and make it for y'all. So what we got is um, two plastic pots, or the long ones, um, some soil, a light lamp for whenever the sun is not out because it tends to be a bit cloudy. Um, what else? Um, well, let's go see. So this is the lamp that we got. We got one of these. So we got some onions and some peppers that we're gonna start out with. He is putting some holes in this so that the water can drain down into that bin. And then this is the soil that we got. So I'll come back and show y'all after we get it all set up. So he has just six holes in here. And then I think, I, I was just thinking fill it up, you know, something like that. Did it smell like what? Dirt. <laughs> dirty, dirt. Smell dirty. Mmm, yummy. It's got that food in it. And this is not a tutorial at all. We are learning together right now. <laughs> if, if they sprout, it'll be good. And if they don't, we'll just have to figure it out. I think we're gonna put um, like maybe two seeds in a hole. I was thinking maybe do onions on one side and peppers on the other side. What do you think? Maybe do one kind of pepper? Oh, shoot. Woo! Woo! I'm gonna make a mess. What you think about that? What? Is that deep enough? I'm gonna probably do a bit more. You think maybe like it must be like water it and then till it. Yeah, I'm trying to compact it and stuff. Yeah. Sure. Well, it's it's not gonna stay soft right now. It'll get hard over time, I think. Yeah. So now he is drilling some holes in this plastic bottle so we can uh, water the soil and get it moist, and then we can uh, probably water the plants with it too. We'll see. Oh no! Wait. You gonna do the bottom of it instead? Yes. Where's uh? Dang. We needed to sprinkle it though. We want it can't it can't sit in there. So we decided to put holes so in water, water in it. Yep. Put holes in the bottom of this bottle to make like a little sprinkle system to get it moist. Not too moist. Just enough. Um, we just just let that go and then uh, let me till it. You just want you want to be able to put your finger in there, and um, it be it feel wet to you. We need some more. It's too dry still. It shouldn't be flurrying up in the air. That's how you know it's still too dry. Okay, sprinkle system. Yeah, I need some more, right? 
Yep. Maybe get that big cup. So I did go ahead and use the seeds from some orange, red, and green bell peppers that we had. We we're gonna throw away, but we kept the seeds. Um, you can just, I put the paper towel in there just to keep them dry, but you don't have to go out and buy any seeds from the store. You can go ahead and just use the seeds that you have and place two to three of them in um, some soil, and which I went ahead and did in three different places. So one hole is orange pepper, one hole is red, so we ended up adding quite a bit more soil than what you saw there and we just did peppers that we already had the seeds from some bell peppers red green and orange and we just spaced them out a good bit and then these are the first two sprouts and the third came sometime later so here I'm showing you all the setup that we have. I do have the uh, plants near a, want a window and this is kind of our sprinkler system we use with the two bottles. We um, got the lamp uh, taped up with those things that you put on the wall, not tape, but those sticky um, things that you can hang pictures up with. That's what we have um, holding the lamp at the bottom of that table. And then we kind of made like a humid humidity system with saran wrap over top of the plants. And here you see all three of the plants. This was, this was the biggest one. But here you see all three of the plants have sprouted red, green, and orange bell peppers. And then we have a heating um, pad underneath it that we got from Home Depot as well. We found that the soil was a bit moist uh, without using that heating pad. So if you do live in a colder place, this is maybe gonna be a game changer for you along with these grow lights. Uh, I am gonna start my own compo compost pile with this trash can I'm gonna show you guys at the end of this clip. So if you guys would like to see that, please stay tuned. Um, so yeah, whenever um, these start to grow a bit more, I'm gonna repot them in uh, three separate pots for the three different peppers so you guys uh please thank you so much for watching and i'll show you guys the sticky uh picture frame holders that i use at the end of this as well please don't forget to like comment subscribe for more and i will see y'all next time bye you say you love me but i don't think that is true it's 